So we are looking at the Zachariah Path to Glory. We'll talk about upgrades and much more on how that all works at the end of the video. But as you can see here, six foot three, high high, right footed, three star, three star, can play CDM or center mid. He's got a massive upgrade as well. We'll add really good short pass, long pass, great acceleration of sprint speed. He is already lengthy as well, so that's going to be a massive bonus. Really good stand tackle, slide tackle, great composure. Not the best agility and balance, but I don't think it'll matter too much. Great strength and stamina, but no traits, unfortunately. We'll talk about Kemp Styles pricing and much more at the end of the video. I'll be also mentioning about uh, where I feel like his best position is as well. But that being said, let's go jump into some gameplay. So with Zachariah, we are going to play him in the CDM role next to Casemiro and Kessie. They're very, very similar players, so that's going to be our main comparison. If he drives forward, we'll obviously look at his ability to finish. But his main job really is just to win the ball for us. Defensively, how good he is, his awareness, and of course, transitioning into attack. I'm interested to see how far Switzerland go, because obviously how upgrades work are very, very interesting. If they qualify through each round, they get a different type of upgrade. So Zachariah could be a crazy card, as we do try and find him here just offside, unfortunately. As you can see in this system, he plays in the two CDM role there. And we're going to get him back now on the ball. Good interception. Look how big he is on the ball as well. Nice composure. Good tackle into the space. Back in again. Zachariah's got options. Ronaldo running there. Nice little play. A little one-two if we can. I've got the option down the bottom. What a ball from Zachariah there. First time shot. And good block. But you can see that's where we're going to be playing him. Trying to win the ball there. And basically trying to transition. Ball up. He's going to drive into the space. Driving all the way. Ball roll. Oh, very unlucky. Seems very, very quick in the full stride. And that's down to that lengthy meta. That's for sure. Here is Zachariah again. Picking up. Straight into Ronaldo. It's a poor pass, I have to say. Good interception, though. Great defensive awareness. there to stand in the way. Zachariah picks up. Takes a shot. And we have actually got a goal with him. Just by pushing him up by accident. So at least we know he can finish with the 70 shooting. But if you look at the card stats, he looks like a fantastic box-to-box -box and CDM for sure. Zachariah there again. Straight into the pocket. I love that he can play that pass. So he played the next one. That's a good ball in. Terrier from long range. Got the keeper off the line. And we've got two assists there for Zachariah. Sorry, one assist there for Zachariah and a goal from the CDM role causing a lot of problems. So what we've been doing is picking the ball up here. It's like I'm getting a rage quit here. He's just transitioning just like that. Then Zachariah looking for the space. Not the quickest at executing skill. Kind of to be expected. Zachariah does pick the loose ball up. Driving again. Looking to go full speed. Can't be stopped. Outside the foot shot. Why not? And good save, unfortunately. What his recovery speed is. And again, absolute amazing tackle from him there. Driving in. Plays the ball into the space. Waiting for him to open up. Again, on the ball. Very good at doing the LB dribbling. I must add a CD. Getting through two or three. Not the greatest with the weak foot pass, so I have to say. Offside and then bring him back onside. Just like that. Little layoff to Ronaldo. Surely that's another assist for Zachariah. And that's something I really like about this card. Is you can push him forward into the space like that. Get him to bounce back on. And as you can see there, he's got himself another assist. So two assists, one goal. And our opponent has race quits. Let's go jump into a second game. So into our second game now then. So far, so good with Zachariah. Not noticing many problems with him at all, especially when he gets into full speed. He's like a runaway train. As we get him here, again, nice tackle. Not sure that was a foul ref, but causing the problems. His recovery speed is so fast. Here he is here now. Been dragged out, but look, instantly back into position. Not a problem at all. Making the tackle. Very unlucky not to get away with that tackle then. Zachariah, a bit up the pitch at the moment. We don't mind that. I'm going to get him into the full speed. As you can see here, off he goes on his run. Little ball roll. Oh, look at that for a pass. No little pass there. It's a shame we didn't capitalise on it. But you can see, playing those intricate passes, he's very good at doing that. Off, plays the ball in. Lovely little pass. One, two. Got options down the wing. Left foot, right foot, doesn't matter. Shot across goal. And we've got an assist again with Zachariah. Very lucky our left back tucked that away. But you can see there, left foot, right foot, doesn't matter too much at all with his passing. Getting out of position, but look how quick he is back in, pressuring the striker straight away. Driving with that lengthy meta. One more pass. Oh, rounded player here. Reese James for the finish, and there is another assist for Zachariah. We are splitting open the opposition here. His ability to transition into defense straight into attack. Again, winning the ball instantly. One pass in, into the pocket. You can see here, just driving forward. His ability to transition from both there. Look, not the worst pass to get away with it. Back out again, keeping that pressure on. Zachariah. Just he's just all over the place in terms of where you need him to be controlling the game. All right, the top, just sitting back, playing those long balls into the place. That's that's what I mean. That type of pass. We could get the shot off there. That could have been another assist for Zachariah from nice and deep. 
bit of skill into Ronaldo. Takes a shot, and that's another assist for Zakara. I think we've seen enough gameplay to really talk about the card. Let's go jump onto Footbin. So how it works is they need to qualify from the group stage to get one in form, win the round of 16 for a second in form, win the quarterfinals for a five-star weak foot upgrade, win the semifinals for a five-star skill move upgrade, and then win the World Cup altogether for another in form. So I'd imagine they get out of their group stage. We will have a look now to see exactly where they are in their group and who they have, sorry. So as we can see here, Switzerland have a bit of a tough group. They've got Brazil, Serbia, and Cameroon. So it's a really, really hard one to predict. If he does get one upgrade and we go to the card now, he's going to be 80, uh, 87 rated, which is going to make him a crazy card. So you see his price is about 528 in a minute. It'll continue to drop down, I'd imagine, as we go through. But we had a shadow on him to really boost up his statistics, and it makes him the best CDM you can possibly use in the game. In terms of Premier League links, he just becomes so, so good. He's so big being six foot three with lengthy. He absolutely dominates the box. And he becomes an absolute powerhouse. You can see here a 90 rated centre back or an 89 rated CDM. So it honestly depends what your team is looking at. But with the Chelsea links and the Chelsea players that we have now, he is a great addition, that is for sure. Um, in terms of him playing, I thought he was very, very good going forward. Really good at executing skill moves, even though he's got freestyle weak foot. Didn't feel that clunky, and his passing was so good, especially being 82 and 87 pass. Made a massive difference for me. Seemed to win a lot of tackles, especially with that defensive awareness, stand tackle, slide tackle, boost, and boosted so much with the shadow. I found him sitting in the pocket really well. We had him as a lone CDM with two kind of similar players around him. I think he's very, very similar to Casemiro and very, very similar to Kante. So if you're looking for someone to fill that void, he's definitely the shout. If you have any more questions about this card or any other card, comment down below. I didn't cover too much gameplay because... Basically, there's only so many times I can show you him tackling. I can show you him scoring and getting assists, but that's not really his role. There are a few of those in the footage, of course. But tackles are the main thing. I noticed he dominated the midfield really, really well. And if he does manage to grab a few upgrades, you are laughing with this card. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. See